Hi, I have the July 2018 Look Fantastic Beauty Box to show you. Um, confession, I haven't looked up spoilers this month because I completely forgot to do so. So let's get on with it. I do remember seeing a teaser last month that uh, the box was golden colored. So I'm presuming there's fake tan inside. Apart from that, I don't know anything. I don't even know what the theme is. I think it was something to do with gold or bronze. Summer, I suppose. And yes, the box is a bronzy gold, quite apt for the summer then. So let's see what's inside. You have the Beauty Box magazine, which is also the product card. We'll take a look at that a little later. And this month's LUK magazine. That would make a great read for the weekend when you're in the bath. And in the lid, it says, Com more Rebi, sunlight filtering through the trees, the interplay between light and leaves. That sounds very, very pretty, very summery and very pretty. So the box is themed, Golden Goddess. That explains the design of the box. And it says, July is all about embracing your inner goddess. This month, we have focused on how you can tailor your beauty regime. Uh, to fit the summer season with a step-by-step -step guide to the best summer hairstyles, top-rated beauty products that will protect you from the sun and learn how to make your own body shimmer. Wow. So get ready to get your glow on this summer. Um, I would love to learn how to make my own body shimmer. Where is the recipe for that? Oh, there's a spoiler for the next month. There's Molten Brown next month. Molten Brown is my absolute favourite shower gel. Um, I, I don't think I love Sharjah anywhere near as much as I love Moulton Brown. I love uh, their pink pepper pod, the white sandal one, lots of different fragrances from them. Ah, here we are. DIY body shimmer. What you need? Clear body spray. Have that, I think. Rose or argan oil. I think I have argan oil somewhere. Glitter pigment. Don't have that. Pipette. Don't have that either. Using a clean pipette, add argan or rose oil to the body spray. If you have oily skin, the oil is optional, but it does add more of a dewy finish. I don't have oily skin on my body. My face is a different matter altogether. Then dip the same pipette into the glitter pigment of your choosing as the oil will help the glitter stick to the pipette. Add as much pigment as you wish to the mixture of spray and oil. Make sure to use different colored pigments to achieve a gorgeous mixed tone glow. Uh, seal the bottle and shake until you're certain that the contents are successfully mixed. Spray onto skin and enjoy all over body shimmer under the sun. That sounds like a lot of fun to try out. And let's see what's inside. So, one, two, three, four, five, six products in this month's box that I can see. And first up, oh, there's a highlighter. That seems to be uh, the only makeup product in here. Let's see if that's the case. Yes, there's one makeup product, and that is a highlighter from a brand called Duce or Duce. I'm sorry, I don't know how to pronounce it. I think it's Duce or Duce. It's called the Freematic Highlighter, and this is the shade Sparked Ray. So let's see what the highlighter looks like. It's beautifully packed, I must say. We've seen eyeshadows from this brand before in a, a Look Fantastic box earlier this year, and I really liked those eyeshadows. They're quite pigmented, so I'm pretty sure the highlighter is quite uh, good quality as well. There's magnets behind, so you can put it in your magnetic palette, which is a great idea. So that's the colour. So let's see how it looks. I, I also think this will be flattering enough on a variety of skin tones, including my own, which is always good to know. Because that's a problem with uh, receiving makeup in beauty boxes. The colour is often a problem, but in this case, it's quite universal, I think, and it's quite flattering on me. So let's see what the product card says about the highlighter. Ah, here we are. Duche, Duche, Freematic Highlighter Mono, uh, Sparked Ray. No golden goddess look is complete without a touch of highlighter to illuminate and brighten those, those cheekbones. 
This amazing free matic highlighter from Dulce in Sparked Ray will give you a natural shimmer, leave you ready to glow and will suit most skin tones. That's a very good choice from them. Enlightening your complexion, the Super Velvety Smooth Highlighter will blend dreamily to accentuate your natural features. It's not at all chunky, it's quite smooth. I'm really impressed with how it worked. So that's a highlighter. Let's see what's next in here. There is a Kerastas uh, shampoo. For it's a multi protecting shampoo for color treated or highlighted hair. I've never colored my hair, never, never, never. I don't know why. I did end up with uh, bleached, sun bleached hair uh, after playing cricket out of the sun without any <laughs> sun protection for the hair uh, during my mad university years. I mean, is this sulfate free? Let's find out. No, unfortunately, it is not sulfate free. The second ingredient after water is sodium lauryl sulfate. So I won't be using it. Oh, there's also sodium lauryl sulfate. So lots of sulfates in here. Um, I can't use sulfate shampoos. My hair is frizzy and dry at the best of times. It's a poof ball. And uh, with all the humidity, um, I don't think I will be using this. So this one will go into the giveaway box. Uh, what does it say in the product card though? I don't understand why there is a color protecting shampoo in a golden goddess box though. Ah, that's why. This shampoo contains vitamin E and UV filters. That is why, that is why it is there in the golden goddess box. Defending hair against antioxidant aggressors and premature color fading, that's why. That explains it. But I'm um, not a fan of sulfate shampoo, so I won't be using it. Next up, there's something from First Aid B, and yes, it is not the Ultra Repair Cream. I think I have about a dozen Ultra Repair Cream samples from various beauty boxes and gifts with purchases. So this is the face clean, Pure Skin Face Cleanser. That's quite nice. I haven't tried this one before. Let's see what the product card says. First Aid Beauty Face Cleanser. Tackle those imperfections and impurities with this amazing cleanser by First Aid Beauty. This unique pH balance formula is filled with a range of antioxidants which works even for the most sensitive skin. It cleanses your face and neck, leaving you fresh, makeup free, and with a more even looking complexion. You had me at imperfections and impurities, got loads of those. So this is uh, one ounce and it goes into my travel bag. So the shampoo, sorry about this, is 80 mils. Next up is something from Philoga. I'm a huge fan of Philoga. Philoga has a lip plumping balm, which is, in my opinion, the best uh, lip balm that I've ever used. It sort of uh, flatters and removes the lines on my lips uh, each time I use it. So I sort of make it a point to use it before any special occasions that I might have. And I've actually bought two of those. So this is the UV Bronze After Sun um, Tan Booster Gel. Um, a triple action gel to oil formula with a light and refreshing texture that pacifies and calms the skin after a tanning session by the pool. Enriched with argan, apricot, almond and avocado oil, hyaluronic acid and an amino acid complex, this formula contains all the essentials to nourish and intensely moisturize the skin. Say hello to your sun-kissed glow. That sounds lovely. I haven't actually gone near fake tan in a while. I used to be a fake tanner. But um, first of all, I did get naturally tanned a lot. Secondly, um, ever since I started becoming very, very acneic in late 2015, and then went through a horrifying acne year in uh, 2016, I haven't really gone near fake tan. Um, but I would love to use this on my legs, which are looking a bit um, on the paler side compared to the rest of my body. So I'll use this on my legs and see how it goes. So this is 15 mils of product. So next up, we have SVR Laboratory Sebia Clear Gel Moussant Gel Cleanser. So there are two cleansers in the same uh, box. That's interesting. Uh, a surf free cleanser, good, uh, that purifies and unclogs the skin gently. It's creamy foam. Oh, this foam is there. Um, eliminates impurities and excess sebum without drying out the skin, leaving the skin perfectly clear, fresh and matte. Is there sulfate? No, there is no SLS. Good. Um, no, unfortunately, there is SLS. I'm sorry, I didn't notice that. It was way below. It was behind um, all the cocoa betaine and the glyceryl uh, cocoa and cocoa and uh, 
uh, all the other P R P E G and things like that. But there is sulfate, I'm afraid. There is sodium lauryl sulfate. So I'm not a fan of sodium lauryl sulfate near my face. And it doesn't say that this one is pH balanced. The First Aid Beauty Cleanser, on the other hand, is not only sulfate free, but is also pH balanced. And I have issues with the moisture barrier on my face, you know, acne and everything. I mean, I've told you about my acne journey. So a sulfate cleanser is not something I want to put on my face. I'll probably use this as a body wash while traveling. This should be good enough. This 10 mils, this should be good enough for about uh, three or four uses uh, on the body. So um, I'll be chucking this into my travel bag to use as a body gel, body, body wash. So the last product is from Lanza, good. I hope it's not that uh, scrub polish that they have. No, it's not. It is the Omega Hydrating Oil. That's great. A facial oil. Marvelous. This lightweight balancing oil delivers essential hydration, polyphenols and antioxidants to the skin, promoting a softer, healthier looking complexion for all skin types. This nourishing blend of fermented oils, including argan, olive, shunko and licorice, Help lock in moisture, softening the look of fine lines and leaving the skin with a dewy glow. And there is 15, no, yes, there's 15 mils of product. That's great. Let's take a look. Oh, how cute. This also goes into my travel bag because I'm a huge facial oil junkie. And uh, it's great to receive a facial oil in uh, this size. You know, I, I have full-size facial oils and cart loading them around is difficult. So I'm always looking for travel size bottles. Normally I decant them into travel size bottles, but now I can use this as my go-to travel facial oil. So six products in there. Loved the highlighter, loved the face cleanser, and loved the facial oil. Not a huge fan of the sulfate shampoo or the sulfate uh, body, I mean face cleanser, which I will be repurposing as a body wash. Um, and I'm sort of on the fence about the uh, Filorga fake tan because uh, I as I told you I'm not huge on fake tan I wouldn't mind using some on my legs but you know it isn't an absolute necessity for me at any point so out of the six products that I received I really like three which isn't so bad I mean last month's box I liked better I could use everything in there uh, this month there are two products which I didn't really like one I can repurpose but this one I can't use at all so it goes into the giveaway box I do hope that next month's box contains products, all of which I can use. So that's the box for those who came in late with Fantastic Ships Worldwide. They have a monthly beauty box. Uh, each box costs £15 and uh, they are mostly skincare and bath and body centric rather than makeup centric. But you do have one to two makeup products in each box these days, which is quite nice to see. Um, if you are on a longer term subscription, the boxes cost less. I pay about 11 ish pounds per box because I'm on a long-term subscription. The good news is that you don't have to prepay anything. They only charge you when they ship the box. And shipping is mostly free. Link to subscribe is in the description box below. So I'm really looking forward to next month's box because it contains my absolute favorite charger brand, Milton Brown. And you know, it's always nice when you get uh, Milton Brown and projects that you love in beauty boxes so you don't have to repurchase uh, for a while. So that's all from me for today. Thank you for watching this video. Please do give me a thumbs up and please do hit the subscribe button and I'll speak to you soon.